today on The Freezes. We are so excited to be on our way to Page, Arizona, where you can get two of America's must-see places crossed off your list. Horseshoe Bend and Antelope Canyon. Brian and I will show you an affordable RV location that's right in the middle of all the action so you can get both of these icons knocked out in just one day. We're just coming off a week of great boondocking in Colorado, so Page, Arizona is quite the distance, like 11 hours. We're going to need to find a solid place to rest our eyes, a dump station, and fresh water during our drive today. When we're road tripping, finding places like this has been a pain and still can be. But that's where Campendium comes in, and we really like it for situations just like this. We ended up getting gas right here on this corner, and now we are coming to Del Nor, which is right here. And they have a Del Norte City RV Park dump station. So we're going to stay right on track, go into Durango. Wow, guys, look at this. This is awesome. RV dump station and water for RVers is free. Safe travels. How awesome is this? Crazy thing is, last year we played Frisbee with Sergi in this exact same park. Isn't this life just crazy? I would have never thought a year later that we'd be in the exact spot where we were paying last year because we were so new and so fresh. This year we're doing it all pretty much for free, boondocking, getting our fresh water when we can, finding these dump stations when we can. Campendium app came through again, also the Hip Camp app. Check it out. Nice and clean too. And we love seeing this. Check this out. I guess this is a one size fits all. <laughs> wow. <laughs> the job that nobody likes. Hi guys, I'm Brian. And I'm Darian. We're the Freezes. Currently, we're traveling America in our travel trailer full time with our dog, Sergi. We sold our house in 2022, and since then, home is where we make it. We've traveled over 15,000 miles, 170 locations, and over 13 states so far. On this channel, we share our RV life experiences, hacks, and all of our locations, all with an emphasis on boondocking and off-grid. If that sounds like something you'd be into, subscribe to our channel right now by clicking here. And let's get back to the video. We found home for the evening. Check it out. Maverick parking lot, baby. That's what we're doing. We're just gonna stay here for a couple of hours and then make our way to some warm weather. But it looks like we got some friends potentially joining us. What's up guys? We're at the Maverick. Look at this. It's easy. Okay, we just drag the line out, plug it into our inverter in here. I already have the batteries charged to 100%. So we're good to sleep here for as long as we want and then hit the road right in the morning. That's right. Thank you so much for the great stay, Maverick. Yeah, it wasn't bad, was it? It sure wasn't. We'd do it again. Definitely. Yeah, we're fueled up and ready to go. One nice thing about making this a pit stop. Is it really nine out? Oh. I think it might be. Is it nine? Yeah. Late start! Yeah. <laughs> well, it's not really late. Do this in one day or two, you'll want to book your canyon tour before anything else because it's only accessible with a tour guide. There are many different tour guide companies to choose from, so if you don't find the time slot you're after, just keep looking. Then you can visit Horseshoe Bend on either side of your tour time. Opinions vary widely on the best time to visit either place. We ended up booking a mid-afternoon canyon tour for our best chance at Sunbeam Pictures, and we would save Horseshoe Bend for sunset. Nice. Staying at Beehive Campground, which is part of the Glen Canyon Recreational System. 
This campground is boondocking only and costs 14 bucks a night. You do have a distant view of Lake Powell from here, but that's pretty much it. The reason why we're here is the price and that it's so close to Horseshoe Bend and all the tour companies for Antelope Canyon. The entrance of the canyon is a few miles away, so we all piled in the tour bus and started down the long desert wash. staircase back up there's the entrance right there our tour guide was a little pushy when you constantly get told that you're not looking at the right spot and that you're not taking the right photo but he's all right it is beautiful although the National Park Service doesn't charge admission to Horseshoe Bend the parking lot is owned by the city of Page and they charge a $10 parking fee and the hike to the Overlook is 1.5 miles round trip, but it is on a hard surface. <laughs> Look at this place. We are here on a Monday, Monday afternoon, 4:30. So busy. It's like Woodstock. This is crazy. Hopefully, it'll be worth it. These places are extremely popular, so plan on never being alone. Like ever. Ever. Never. Ever.
If you like this video and want to see more like it, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel by selecting that button down there below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.